C sharp. It is a popular programming language that may be used for a range of purposes such as mobile application, game development, and enterprise software. C sharp brings up a lot of opportunities for you as a developer. C sharp was introduced by Microsoft together with the .NET framework and Visual Studio. C sharp was recognized as an international standard by ECMA in 2002 and by ISO in 2003. And on that note, hey everyone, I'm Babu Khandalwal and I welcome you all to yet another exciting video from Simply Learn. In this session, we will be discussing C Sharp interfaces. However, before we begin, make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel and clicked on the bell icon below so you never miss an update from Simply Learn's YouTube channel. Let's look at the agenda for today's topic. We shall begin our session with an introduction to interfaces in C Sharp. After that, we will discuss why do we need interfaces in C Sharp. Finally, we will conclude this session with an implementation of C Sharp interfaces. Let's get started with what is interfaces in C Sharp. Interfaces in C Sharp is like a blueprint of a class. It is like an abstract class because all the methods which are declared inside the interface are abstract methods. It cannot have a methods body and cannot be instantiated. We name an interface with a capital letter I in the syntax as you can see here. Next, let's discuss why do we need interfaces in C Sharp. Since in C Sharp we can use inheritance using classes, so to overcome that issue we use interfaces. Interfaces are basically used to build loosely coupled application. This means that components are not dependent on each other and any altercation will not impact the application itself. Let's say for example there are two classes drawable and shape. Now this drawable class is dependent on shape class since it can only draw shapes if there are set shape defined in the class. This dependency is due to them being tightly coupled. Now, let's say we have an interface drawable. Now, this interface can easily communicate with different classes and it will not affect the main goal to draw the shape. Finally, let's implement this interface in C Sharp. Let's start with using system. Let's start with creating an interface. So public interface drawable We always use capital I in front of the name as in common nomenclature for interface. These interfaces don't have access specifier like in classes like public, private, or protector. So we will simply define void a function draw. Now we don't define any for methods in the interface itself. So we will now create a class. So public class rectangle. Drawable. Now we will call the function draw so public void draw
not to draw we will write console dot write line and we will print drawing rectangle to give the proof that we are accessing this drawing function for the from rectangle now let's write another class circle so public class circle colon i drawable and we will call public void draw and we will print using console dot right line and we will print drawing circle now let's make another class public class test now we will declare our main here so public static void main Now we will declare an object for the interface. Now this object will use to create an object for the rectangle. and then we will call draw d dot draw to access rectangle now let's define this d for the circle so d is equals to new circle and then we will again call draw to draw this circle now let's save this and run it as you can see here we are able to call rectangle and circle classes using draw function with the help of interfaces now let's get back to our slides and this was all for today's session Hope you guys found it informative and helpful. If you like this session, then like, share, and subscribe. If you have any question, then you can drop them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more from Simply Learn. Hi there! If you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.